here's my sample assignment and then if i click upload it redirected me to the next step hi there danica here and i designed wordpress membership site in this video we are gonna continue on the dive deep that we are doing for the display and content options that learn dash offers for your lessons and topics in the previous video we have discussed about the video progressions how it works all of the stuff on their um, features in here so if you've missed that video please watch that one before you proceed to this one so that you could check which option is the right one for your content again a note that the lesson materials is not affected with the three options in here but for the video progression assignment uploads and the fourth lesson timer or topic timer you need to only select one so it's either video progression assignment uploads or force lesson timer this options gives some gamified feeling as well or more like interactive feeling to your enrolled user so it's very nice if you could take advantage of this functionality that being said let's now start on the assignment upload functionality for your lessons and topics here in learn dash so if you turn on the assignment uploads on the settings you can see that it now says or gives this available options again there's a thin line where it starts and stops for what is that content for so it doesn't confuse you so here it says file extensions so if we select this it says specify the type of files user can upload so if you enable assignment for your lessons or topics you could limit which file type your enrolled member can provide for that assignment you could leave it blank so that you don't limit they could upload pdf spreadsheet file zip file and so on as long as you have your hosting um, support and has the enough space there should be no problem file size limit um, default maximum file size supported is controlled by your host so yep that is correct so if you need like a larger than this um i think it's only let me just check so it says that this is the maximum upload size so if you need more than that you may want to talk to your server and see if they allow more than 150 mb next is we have points so if we enable this we could give like 100 points if they have completed this assignment so another gamification and i'm sure you could take advantage on this especially if you're using like an app for gamification like game impress now all assignment needs some grading and it's either admin or a group leader could do that so there's a two option for the grading type it's either auto approve so after they upload their assignment automatically it is graded as correct so the assignment will be automatically approved and the full points will be awarded or manually grade so an admin or a group leader needs to approve the submitted assignment before this assignment is marked as complete or graded the lessons cannot be complete until the assignment is approved so again it stops your member or enrolled user to complete this lesson until they complete this as assignment once you have enabled the assignment uploads so just like the video progression it creates that stopping and it also pushes your member to engage more on your content rather than just marking things complete right away so the manually grade could limit the number of upload so you could set here if we check this so maybe if you need more than that you could also um, set that here so maybe you need you could allow them to upload too depending on your setup you could do that allow file deletion so if you enable that your members can um, delete their own uploaded files it says this is only possible up until the assignment has been approved so maybe after you have like approved the assignment and for some reason that member just want to remove that from their profile you could turn this on so let's just um see how this works in action so i'm not gonna limit a file file size or file type for now i'm not gonna give any points 
And if I preview this one, oops, I think I have marked this complete from my end. So I'm going to manually remove that for now. Okay, so refresh. Okay, so let's try that again. So example, if I first complete this topic. So if I completed that, the assignment will then show on the lessons page. And then I could upload um, a file in here. In our settings, it's set to auto approve. And then I'm gonna create a file and upload that here. So here's my sample assignment. And then if I click upload, it redirected me to the next step because that completed the lessons for me. And it says approved. Now, as an admin or a group leader, if I go to the lessons and assignment, you could see that there was a submitted assignment in here. You could see the title of the file or the name of the file, who submitted that. In my case, I submitted it myself. So it is assigned to me. And then status approved and then points not enabled. So I haven't set the lessons to give out points. So that's why. Assign courses and then assign lessons or topics. So it's very clear. You could easily see that. So um, that which lesson or topic this assignment belongs to. So if I open this assignment, I could check this here. So maybe I'm just going to collapse stuff that I think I don't need. And then here I could as an admin download that file. So if I example download this you can see the submitted assignment there's a comment section and if you notice there is a comment section in the front end as well so if we add some comment like good job so now the comment is also on the front end and as a member of this lesson i could see that comment or else maybe you could add some correction like please adjust this and so on you could add that comment in here next let's try to add some points so i'm just gonna give some points and i'm gonna do manually graded and i'm gonna do one file maximum like maximum file upload this one only if I publish that, go back here. Well, it's already approved, so doesn't count. So I deleted the assignment to test. I'm going to empty that for now. Let's see if that works. Refresh. Okay, no assignment. I'm going to upload my assignment again. Now you can see that message after uploading the file. Um, it says assignment successfully uploaded and then you also have this one. So it says waiting for approval. So in here waiting for review, there's no comment. And since we have like enable the allow file deletion, oh, we haven't done that yet. But if we try to do this here, okay, so you could. So I've actually able to delete that file. So let's just try that again. Is that a bug? Let's check. So I could do that. And then example, if I... So this is not yet approved and I haven't checked this yet. Maybe it's because this has not been reviewed by the admin yet. But let's try and confirm that. So in here, I'm going to do... On the settings, we set available points the max that's actually the maximum one so we could give up to um 100 but let's just say i'm just gonna give 90 and then i'm gonna approve this i'm also gonna give some comment nice and then let's refresh okay so i have the comment that says nice 
and i also have the 90 over 100 points awarded okay so now that x um or delete option is gone so this option works when the assignment is approved so let's try that again so enable that and this is approved right but i can't do anything so if i refresh Okay, so even if this is enabled, so actually I can't as well remove the assignment. So the instruction was this only possible up until the assignment has been approved. So I think there was a bug. So supposedly, even if I should have enabled this before they could delete their assignment. But as you can see, once the assignment has been approved, then that deletion will not work. So I'm going to do another test. So with the allow file deletion off. So let's just do that. okay upload so i can delete here yes but example if i allow file deletion refresh let's do that again upload and then here i'm gonna do 95 and then approve i'm gonna give some comment nice refresh i have the comment and the points and i can't delete it so that's right so we could this is i think there's a bug in here supposedly they should only been able to delete that one like even before the admin or group leader approved the assignment if this was on but i think it's not working so that may be a bug that they may be working on that one so turn on or off the enrolled user could remove their uploaded file until the admin or group leader approved that once it's approved then they could no longer remove that assignment from their end let me just check how that looks on the profile side details okay so far there's no like meta value or data related to the assignment from this end on the profile so i guess the login member will rely on their uploaded file that's attached in here so they could still see that one and they could even comment with their instructor or group leader for that one so i think the last one that we haven't tested is the limit the number so let's just do that so once you have enabled for them to upload more than one the upload section is back and you could like browse again in here and as you can see again even if we haven't turned this on i can see like remove this from my end so that's working and i could upload another one and wait for the admin to approve that and if i approve that as an admin approve refresh so i could no longer again remove that okay so that's it for the assignment upload feature for your learn dash topics and lessons i hope this video helps i got stuck with this um deletion i haven't I don't use this most of the time i just simply ignore this part but now in this lesson i realized that i think that's a bug and maybe learn dash guys is still working on that one so yeah just a note on that one and if you have any question regarding the assignment uploads please comment it down below i hope this video helps and again thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one Bye bye